see I'm obsessed with thick women and I agree Yeah, that's right, I like my girls, BBW Yeah, type they wanna suck you dry, nigga, it's a nice to Yeah, so thick that everybody else in the room is so uncomfortable Ass on you from Texas, but the face look just like Claire Huxtable, oh! Hi guys, welcome back to my channel For those of you who don't know me, I am Bria Javier And those of you who do, welcome back to my chickadees I'm here, we are here, to slay, well really just to try on some clothes, but I have a boohoo haul for you today, um, this is my first time ordering from boohoo, I kind of was on the fence back and forth because I really didn't know how their sizes were, you know how online shopping is, so I just jumped out there, it, I had to wait a little bit for the second package because I did have two packages for them, um, but it was like a little weather thing, so it came a little later, so I should have been posted this, but hey, what can you do? So before we even get started, if you have not already, click that subscribe button. Don't play. Don't even waste time. Also, click the notification so you can get notified every time that I post. Okay? So I'll give you a second to do that, and then we can get on the ball. Oh, you did it? Okay, great. That way I know you'll be back the next time, and we will not be strangers. Okay? So, um... Let's not even waste time. Let's get into it. Okay, first items, I guess items because it's a two-piece set, is the Plus Ribbed Knitted Lounge Set in Blush. And it's a 22 in UK sizes, which means it is a 18 in American sizes. I wish I would have gotten a 16 or maybe a 14 because it is huge. But, I mean, I'm going to wear it around the house, so, I mean, can you really be mad? It's super cute. Excuse my drawers. They're like highway so you know whatever hopefully it doesn't make it look bad but we'll get over that but yeah this is really cute love it um definitely would order it again probably gonna get a smaller size if they have a different color yes because i mean who doesn't like to look cute when you're around the house i ain't got no man or name but if i did i'd have this on and i'd be sexy cute you dig next things i got um i got two necklaces um only because i'm always losing my jewelry and I saw they had necklaces. This one I have worn, let's put that down. This one I have worn already. It's really cute. It kind of looks like a double up, like a double neck necklace. And it kind of comes around. It's like a choker at the top and then it's long at the top. So if you can kind of see. It's super cute. I loved it. It looked really cute with the outfit. If you got some low cleavage, even if you don't, if you have something that comes up, it looks really cute with it regardless. I don't know about a turtleneck or anything like that, but you know. And let's not even talk about the burn. It's still there. Eventually, it'll go away. Anyways, next, I got this other chain. Now, I haven't taken this one out. It is called the Plus Kathy Tear Choker Necklace Gold One Size. Duh. Oh, the other one, sorry. The other one was called Chunky Chain and Bar Layered Necklace. And, of course, I will have everything linked below just in case I leave out something, sizes, things like that. If you're interested, you just go down in the um, description bar and you'll be able to take a look. So, excuse the loudness of the plastic. Probably should have took it out. Anyways. So, this is also a layered chain. It's got three little layers. It's a little tangle. I'm going to... Anyways, okay, so you can kind of see how it goes. It's got like this little diamond, hopefully you can see it, little diamond, little circle, and this little cross. Super cute, can't wait to wear it. I'm not going to play no games. So next, I'm going to go through the things that I've basically already kind of worn or have been on my social media or whatever. I'm super mad at myself about this t-shirt because I put this t-shirt on because it was super cute. Then I ended up doing hair later and then some other things and I ruined the shirt. But I will post, I will post what it really looks like. Probably insert it after this little clip. But it says, don't be like the rest. Don't be like the rest of them, darling. Super cute. I mean, it says oversized. I got it in a... 18 as well it wasn't as, as oversized as i like but i mean i have big arms so you can only ask for so much next i have these um plus long line cycling shorts black 
I did get these in a 20 UK, which is a 16. Yeah, a 16 in US sizes. I wore these and I also, okay, let me tell you how much of a loser I am. I did get a plus hoodie panel windbreaker. And like I said, I'm getting the ones that I've already worn out the way because some of it, I just don't know where I put the jacket at. So I'm gonna have to uh, just post a picture. It was super cute, I'll let you know. If you follow me on Instagram, then you already saw the outfit together because I put these two together. So let me show you what they look like. Okay, so these are the long line cycling shorts. I will tell you, they feel good, but honey, they are thin. I hope you ain't seen my butt through it, but if you did, so what? I'm not that insecure, you know? And if you don't like it, you don't have to watch my videos. Point blank, period. But yeah, I, I really like these. I wish they were thicker. And I probably could have got them in a 14 because they still have a lot of space and I like having, like, look, I feel like I wish this was an example of me losing all this weight, but no, it's just too big. But, um, yeah, that's the only thing I really don't like. I don't know if I want to order any more cycling shorts from them because it's just like, okay, if I want to wear them with a short shirt or like a crop top or something like that, I don't want my butt showing in public, especially in Texas because the sun is always out. So that's still in the theme of what I'm on already. I have a plus lace bodysuit in the color berry and some plus super high waisted power stretch jeans, mid blue and 22. So the jeans are at 18 and I'll show them to you. Like I said, I wore these already, so I'll show you together. And I'm putting these together because I'm about to show y'all. I love this bodysuit, okay? But, boo-hoo, don't nobody have a vagina? I mean, are you selling to women without vaginas? Because I'm not skinny, and this is a size, let me look, look, just a second. This is a size 20, which means it's a 16, which I'm very glad I got a 16 and not an 18, because it probably would have been huge. So, let me put this on, and I'll show you what it Hopefully, nothing shows, and I don't get flack. But I didn't zip up yet because I wanted y'all to see how high it goes up, which I don't mind it. And it's not really in my hoo-ha. It's in my back. It's a G-string. It's not a game. But I thought it looked super cute. So let me go ahead and zip. Okay, so with the pants zipped up, it doesn't show as much. I did, hold on. So with the pants zipped up, it didn't show as much. Um, and it was super cute. I wore this with like a blazer and some pumps of this color. And it was really cute, classy, but sexy all at the same. And oh, FYI, I'm thinking about doing lookbooks. Is that something you're interested in? Leave me a comment, let me know. That way you can kind of see how I style stuff up because I have clothes for days and days and days. This is the outfit. These are the jeans. They fit really good, really comfortable. They got a little room in them. You can put a nice little belt. I probably could have got a 16 because of the space. But like I said, I was just really iffy about doing that because of the fact that I never ordered from here before, so I don't really like to return shit. So, I'd rather give it away than return. All right, so I'm using this to cover up my boobies. So, um, this dress right here is the plus off the shoulder twist with twist detail. It just says twist detail. Midi dress, red, and it's a size 16. Super cute. If you have not checked out my Get Ready With Me um, date night, this is the outfit, or if you have seen it, this is the outfit that was on there. Like I said, I'm gonna put the links below because I didn't pull out the prices and do all that for the sake of the length of this video anyway. So it will be posted below. I did get everything when they had an 80% sale and they always have really good sales at Boohoo. That's why I like them. And if they don't, I think the quality of their clothing is good enough that I'm willing to spend my coins and not get a discount. I'm saying a lot. Let's see how it looks. This is the dress on. It is a really decent fabric. Um, I'm trying to pull it up. I really need to invest <laughs> in some surgery, but that's okay. I'm not really messed up about it. You can't really wear a bra with this. And I have the wrong drawers on right now, so don't judge me, you get the picture. So it's this elastic can kind of holds it in, but I don't like it to show, so I folded that in a little bit. And then elastic right here, so you can make it a little 
puffier if you wanted to. You could pull it down a little longer. I feel like you could wear this in the winter with a nice little shawl and get real bougie. And see, you could wear it in the summertime too. Yeah. I just love it. Out of everything that I've tried on so far, if you can't tell, this is by far my favorite. Okay, so back to reality. Um, so the next pair, I got another pair of jeans. I feel like they almost look alike, but they do look different. But I don't really care. Um, these are the Plus High Rise True Blue Jeans in an 18 and US size 22 in UK sizes. Um, like I said, they almost look like the other ones. But they were supposed to be very different, but I don't care. I don't have any, like, dark blue jeans. So, if people think I wore them twice, bitch, I'm clean. The fuck? So, here are these jeans. They fit pretty good, too. I think this size, they don't have as much room as the other ones. I don't know if because I haven't worn them before or, like, anything. Wash them out. My high waists are never that high because you always can see that in the back. And if it covers up my burn, for the most part... I'm with them. So I like these. These are cute. These aren't as long as the other ones. I felt like the other ones were longer, but that's cool. Since I got jeans on, let's go with this. So I also have this Tiger Plus Tiger Fold Print. Fold. I can't read. Plus Tiger Fold Print t shirt in white. And I'll show you what it looks like. So here's what it looks like. It's in a size 20, which is 18, oversized. I'm gonna put it on. It's supposed to be oversized. I thought it would be cute, just like the other t-shirt, even though I ruined it, I'm gonna buy it again. Um, with like a black pencil skirt or a jean pencil skirt, or just some jeans, just like a casual thing. Let's um, hope I can put this on without destroying the neck of it. Let us pray. Oh shit. Let us pray. Okay, so I'm gonna need them. I'm glad the way it fits, but I thought it would look cute maybe with some cycling shorts too. But as you can see, it's not as oversized as I would like it. I probably should have got it in a 20 in US sizes and it would have had a different fit, but that's okay because I still think it's a really cute shirt. I like it, and it's cute with these jeans too. It's a little pump, so you can put some tennis shoes on with it. I'm with it. Y'all like it? You know, I don't even. Like 50s, roll the sleeve up a little bit, or I don't know. Like I said, I'm preparing for a lookbook, so we're gonna see how I style some of these items out. So I have a t shirt dress too. Um, it's called the Plus Yasmin Nothing to Wear t shirt dress. And uh, excuse me if I look a little shiny, because I'm gonna tell y'all right now, trying on all these clothes, a bit get hot. You feel me? Hot. I can't even get this one off the bed. Okay. Let's see. It's supposed to be an oversized t-shirt dress. How some of this oversized is fitting. Um, okay. It should be okay. It's big. Let me see what size I got it in. Okay. So, size 22, which is an 18, which I'm glad I got it in. Because um, it's definitely going to be oversized. I don't know where that glitter came from on there, but it's some glitter on there. You see nothing to wear. I figured something I could dress up and dress down. Either way, I put some booties on, put some tennis shoes on run out to the store, chill with my girl shopping, you know, something, anything, whatever. Let's see what it look like. Here is the nothing to wear t-shirt dress. I love how this feels. I mean, nothing to wear. This is the perfect, I just threw on something to go out of the house type of thing. I love this. It feels amazing. And it's oversized, like, very glad I got an 18 because a 16 probably would have been a little clingy. And that is not the look I was going for. Of course, I have on the wrong drawers today. So it's like lumpy bumpy that bitch. But that's good. That's okay. You know, when I go out, it's different. When I leave the house, it's different. Y'all like this? Eh, eh, mm, mm. Moving right along. So next, we got the plus rib top and midi skirt cord. Coordinates. Coordinates? Yeah. Uh, I like two pieces. I like outfits that come together. And sometimes I don't always wear them together. But I like the option. Because I think they're cute sometimes. You can add some little things for it. So this one is like a long skirt. Just rib. It's kind of the same material as the lounge material. But different. 
this is little crop top that goes with it. I got this in a size 16. Thank the Lord, because 18 would have been too big. Let me put it on for you. Here we go. Again, wrong draws on for this outfit, but I like this. It fits so nice. I wish the lounge set fit like this. I think it feels really nice. Really cute. One of those dress up, dress down type of things. I think it's nice. A nice color on my skin. I would like it in a mustard too. That would be cute. I do. I really like this. What y'all think? Comment below. Make sure you comment below and let me know what your favorite outfit is. Just cuz. <laughs> Just cuz. But yeah. This is it. Okay. Gotta move right along cuz. I got more for you. So the next outfit, I didn't try this on, but I did pull it out the bag. And it is a plus stripe crop and kulak coordinate sets. Told you, I like the two-piece sets. I like the two-piece sets. Makes my job easier sometimes when I'm trying to run and go. So these are the pants. And the top is like... I'm going to have an afro before this is all over with, taking these clothes off and on. But this is a top, it's a little cute little bandeau like top. And this is in a size 16. And this says new, but clearly this is like a blush color. So I don't know what the hell. And I'm kind of nervous because the booby part, I don't, know, I don't know if it's gonna just like hold something up. You may have to wear a, a what you call it, bra so your tits don't hang out the bottom. But we're gonna see and I'm gonna keep my bra on, so just in case. This is the last time I said, I should have just took these drawers off because this right here is not popping, but hey, Zaddy, I like this. Um, yeah, you would definitely need a, you know, strapless bra because underneath, that is not going to help. That's not going to hold anything. It, it's not like the top. But I think this, let me pull it up because I know it's be high. This is cute. Uh, hey, Zaddy, what's your name, Zaddy? I can see myself going to a nice little picnic or barbecue, something like that. I mean, summertime, fine, I'm ready. Uh, ew, you better know it, honey. Y'all like it? I like it, if you can't tell, I like it. It's cute, cute. Take this dumbass bra off, but it's cute, cute. I ain't want my gravity to take it and then they be sitting on the top of these pants. You feel we are getting down to the nitty gritty, the last two outfits. So this first one is a plus asymmetrical button detail mini dress in stone. And I got this in a size 16. Most of my dresses I get in a 16 or 14 because anything bigger than that, I look down. They really don't fit unless it's like something like a t-shirt dress that needs to be oversized or something like that. Oh, it's a belt, let me get it. So, um, so this is how, this is kind of linen. I'm only worried about this because, of course, this is not a dress that stretches. And I know without a steamer, oh my God, it looks huge. Without a steamer or iron or something like this, it's not going to look as cute as it could. It also comes with a belt. Yes, honey, yes, because you need one with it. I can already tell. So, I'm going to slip into this number. I'm showing y'all this because I love y'all. Look at this. Now I wish I would have gotten an 18 or maybe even a 20 at this point because I don't even know if I got it in that size, would it be okay? Like the belt looks dumb. I don't know where it's supposed to go. The buttons are not functional. This is supposed to come off the shoulders. Of course it's wrinkled. I mean, I thought this would be something I could wear like in the daytime. Look at this. Bruh, I'm a... <laughs> I'm gonna put uh, I'm gonna put this pop a picture in here of what it looks like on the person <laughs> because this shit didn't look nothing. I swear to God, maybe I just don't. This shit is ugly as fuck, yo. I don't even know. Maybe if one of my smaller friends like try it on, maybe it'll <laughs> do some. This shit looks so ugly. There's not enough steaming, and it's it has it's so boxy. I don't really know where this is supposed to go because of the buttons. It really, it may be just too small. Maybe it's just cause I'm too big for it, but this shit looks fucking dumb. So 
This is the only thing that I hate. Let's just, let me show you this uh, outfit so I can take this shit off. Cause I hate this. I hate it. Um, so I saved this one cause I feel like it may be my favorite. I hope so. After this, I'm kind of like, but this is the only one that didn't have like stretching. I really should have read the material. So whatever, we're over it. It's ugly, we're over it. Um, but this is the plus button detail. Bardo midi dress. When I saw this on the site, it gave me so many, you know, Marilyn Monroe vibes all day, every day. I really hope that this fits and it looks super cute because I want to end on a good note. Let's end on a good note. Let's end on, hello. I like this. I know. I can't really get to it in the back, so it keeps kind of rolling up. Whatever. Oh, I didn't even tell y'all. I got this in a 14. I like the tightness. The top, I'm probably going to have to play with it a little bit because I really don't know which way it's supposed to sit, but I love this. I feel real, real. We'll, we'll find the words for it. I'll let you know. But this is, yes. Like I said, I'm gonna need a little help folding this over and keeping it folded over. That's the only thing I will complain about, but I have other dresses like that and I make it work, honey. I make it work. That's so, ooh, I got hair on it. I told y'all I was gonna have an afro before it was all done, but this, I'm living. Final thoughts. So overall, how do I feel about Boohoo? I love Boohoo. Aside from that one ugly ass brown outfit, I spent probably $275 on everything there. Everything mostly fit. That was the only bad thing I got out of all those clothes. And I am impressed. Like, I'm going to be doing some more boohoo hauls, y'all, because they got hella clothes on there. Their site, it has so much on there to the point where you got to kind of pull back. Cause you just be clicking shit you know you gotta be like let me weed it out and see what's most important links for the clothing will be at the bottom um along with the prices well if you click the link you'll see the prices because i don't want to give you a price if it's no longer on sale because that'd be a little after you know? thank you so much for the rest for all of you who stayed at till the end leave me please leave me a comment i love to interact with you i love to get your um Opinion on things, what you'd like to see, things like that. I already looked at my Get Ready With Me video. It is going to be linked down below. Also, go check out my other try on haul that I just posted not too long ago. You know the drill. Till the next time. I'm a holly at you.